Yo, what's good everybody? Welcome back to the channel. How y'all doing? Had a kids. I am Q the Costa Rican and today we're back here with some more 6v6 Why did I say that so weird? 6v6 singles Pokemon Scarlet and Violet Wi-Fi battles against random. So If you guys didn't know, the homie Grenadier, Greninja, aka the mightiest Greninja. I forgot what the mark actually meant. It is back. It's in the game. If you guys didn't do the raids, get you a stored power of Vaporeon and get into that raid and get it going. Regardless, we are rocking out with Swords Dance, Liquidation, Night Slash, Terra, Poison, because that's what the raid had, Gunk Shot, Grenadier. Could have changed it, but didn't really have any better options in my opinion, so I was like, whatever, let's just do it. We're asking ourselves the question, which of these three starters that get the ability Protean is the best in the game? Libero, Uncinderace is basically Protean, just renamed. Greninja gets Protean, Meowth Karata gets Protean. We're all trying things out. Uh, Greninja does is the only one without a damage boosting item on, not Greninja, Pleh. Cinderace is the only one without a damage boosting item on, so don't really see. Um, hopefully, he won't be running away with it. Hopefully, it's either Greninja or Meowskarada. But regardless, uh, speaking of Cinderace, that is our hopefully Dondozo bait. Because um, Gren Greninja kind of gets walled by Dondozo just a little bit, just a tiny bit. Um, so, I uh, figured uh, we could bring um, this Terra Electric Electro Ball Cinderace to try and bait the Dondozo in. And get some big damage off on it. We do also have Claude Sire who can Toxic. Um, and then we could go like Hard Meow Skarada and click Bandit Flower Trick and stuff like that. But let's just let's just hope we don't run into a Dondozo to be honest. But regardless, um, the other side of the team, uh, Corviknight is kind of like our blanket check to physical attacking Pokemon. And then Claude Sire is kind of our blanket check to special attacking Pokemon. And then Cyclozar will hopefully enable either Greninja or Meow Skarada to get behind a sub because of the Shed Tail. And click some buttons and do some damage. But with that being said, uh, this is the team that we're going to be using to take on uh, the randomness of the, of that is Wi-Fi battles in Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. Team ID up in the right-hand corner. GS, MNT3, get some money now, times three. I don't know. I, I, I don't know. Acronyms are funny. Uh, but yeah, we're going to ask ourselves the question. Which Protean starter is the best in the game? Is it Greninja? Is it Meowskarada? Is it Chinderace? Who knows? Y'all let me know in the comment section down below which starter you guys like the best that gets the Protean ability, Meowskarada, Gren, or Cinderace. With that being said, I hope you all enjoy the battle. Alright, and here we are with the battle. We do see some Pokemon. Wish I was uh, the Fizz Def Cloud Sire. Instead, I did change it to Spadef because I figured we have Corviknight. Why, you know, why both? So, um, they could get up screens, which would suck. Um, do we have Defog on the Corv? I don't think we do. We do not. And we only have five roots. That's silly. I didn't think to do that. Anyways, um, they could lead off with Palafin. I might just lead off with the Grenadier and get a fucking kill. That's not true. I'm leading off with the cat. Because it looks really good against everything. Um, besides, I guess, like, the dark type. Uh, uh, one of them. Whichever one it is. I can't remember which one it is. We'll see how it goes. Can is Greninja. Is Protean Gren just as good as it used to be? Find out today, folks. You can only change one time. So, you know, but also when you terrestrialize, it just, it doesn't matter anymore. So we'll see what happens. We will see. We will see. I like the helmet, brother. They do lead off with the Grim, the Grimmy Grim. Um, I was going to say Grimadier. So I'm just going to click a uh, flower trick. Um, this will ignore the reflect. Uh, this is really good because <laughs> they only need a reflect, which is kind of funny. But maybe it won't last that long. Let's just flower trick as they reflect. This will, you know, crit through the flower, the reflect, so I might even just Oko them, which would be nice, because playing six against five uh, is always beneficial for our health. Let's see, it didn't knock it out, so a little unfortunate. They can't party, no, they can now, because I'm not a dark type anymore. And they light screen, okay, light screen a little irrelevant. That's cool. So we're wasting, we wasted a turn of reflect, so if they are light clay, there's only seven more turns. Um, so yeah, good stuff. One Mon down. They can pretty easily go into the uh, King Gambit. Well, I haven't said King Gambit's name in forever. They can pretty easily go into King Gambit. Um, I have a Corviknight, though. They go Palafin. Okay. I'm thinking I'm just going to click it again. I'm faster. They have to swap. I'm just going to get free Choice Band Chip on something. Yeah, they flip turn to their Scarf. Okay, that's good to know. Scarf. So nothing fancy. Just Scarf. So we're just going to get... Yeah, we're just going to get Banded Flower Trick Chip on something. Showing off the Protean Mon. The cat, not the, the, the thing. Dragapult the Sociable. Okay. It's pretty cute. 
How much is Banded Flower Trick doing? Uh, not a whole lot, actually. Does does it, do, do you not ignore Reflect with crits? They're lefties. Are you about the DD, bro? Is that what I'm hearing? Are you about the DD? Um, we are going to go out into, I think, Claude. Uh, potentially, they could... Um, they could click sub DD here if they really want to. If they're special lefties for whatever reason, I can get off a nice Toxic here. Toxic seems pretty free. They do Will-O-Wisp. That's fine with me. Okay, so they went for screens and then they're Will-O-Wisp, which is a little silly in my opinion. But hey, you know, who am I to judge? I'm just a guy battling with Pokemon, bro. So yeah, Toxic, super dummy free here. Uh, if they go out into the King Gambit, once again, I have Earthquake. I'm a ground type, so I don't really care that much. Um, but the, the fact that they do click uh, Wisp here makes me believe they might be the Hex set. Uh, so yeah, we're just going to click off Toxic. If they sub, I guess we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. But I don't know. Sub Wisp doesn't really seem... Uh, oh, they do just Hex. So yeah, we should tank this pretty well. Oh yeah, we eat that. So yeah, let's go. Let's go. We get a Toxic off, which is beautiful. And we'll be able to just recover spam now. <laughs> and hopefully we can get the Grenadier in to just click buttons. Maybe Scarf Grenadier is... Special Scarf is better. I am SD uh, with like three attacks because I thought that could be pretty fun. I also kind of want to look at the screen turns to potentially see what's uh, going on with that. We've been deciding our moves pretty quickly here, so I think uh, I think this will be okay. So yeah, let me click it real quick. Uh, this is also really good for Armor Rouge, so we don't just lose to Armor Rouge. Uh, screens, they have one out of five, three out of eight. I don't know what that tells us. I don't know what info. I, I, I'm assuming that means they're light clay. Uh, I'm going to get a pushback. They hex again. Yeah, we can recover the next turn. 168. Yeah, they did 50. Yeah, we can easily spike, recover. Let's go. Getting rid of the Dragapult means that everything on the other side gets outpaced by Grenadier. So, we're good here. This is really good for us. Got rid of the, got rid of the um, Grimmsnarl. And getting rid of this. The only other thing I would really like to get rid of is uh, the King Gambit. Uh, but I guess the Spike is getting some chip on it if it's when it switches in. So that's going to be pretty good. And I do not think they'd be like boots on anybody. So we're going to recover. To live. Um, hits. Obviously. This Hex ain't doing nothing. Even if you crit me, I will be living. Let's go. And then I might just click it again to be a dirtbag. And also it's just the best play to make, to make at the moment. So I'm going to do it again. Claude has some... Freaking HP. Hold on. Are their guys level 100, by the way? Do they not lower it to 50? It doesn't look... They look. It looks like it is 50. I don't know. Does, does Claude have this much HP at level 50? No shot, right? I kind of want to look now. Um, Hold on. Wait for all these animations to go through. Jesus Christ. All these damn animations. Okay, it is level 50. Damn, my man's got 237 at level 50. Kind of crazy. Anyways, um, we could make a power play for no reason and go one of our dark types. Um, on the hex, but that's kind of silly. There's no reason to do that. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna recover again. They do just hex again. See, so yeah, I'm getting back up to full, and now I think, no, I won't. That's just dumb. It'd be really silly just to go out into the dark type. There's like no reason. I'm just gonna earthquake here, and hopefully knock out the dragapult. But my man has been getting some longevity because of his lefties. Shout out to my poison lefties. Also, shout out to Shiny Pult because it is beautiful. I love my man right here. Look at him. Look at him in all his glory. Funny enough, we didn't even bring any Paradox Mods. That didn't even cross my mind. I was like, you know what? Oh, the Reflect wears off. You'll love to see it. We are clicking EQ. I didn't even cross my mind to bring any Paradox Mods. I was just like, you know what? I'm bringing Protean, Protean, Libero. And we're just going to see if we can win a game. <laughs> I thought it'd be funny. But regardless, Claude... That did zero, and we are disabled. But this toxic should knock them out. I feel like. I feel like this toxic. I feel like they've garnered enough chip, or garnered enough. They've been in turn. They've been here for like four turns, no. And if not, then that's fine. We that means we get Cloud Sire back at one hundred percent HP. Um, yeah, we get Cloud Sire back at one hundred percent HP, and and a, and a dead pole, which th then means that Grenadier outpaces everything. On the other side, I guess except for Scarf Palafin, because it is Palafin. It is Scarf Palafin, unfortunately. We did find that out. So yeah, we are going to back up the full. Is this the high octane battles you guys wanted to see me recovering with Claude? Stay tuned, folks, because we're doing it. <laughs> but yeah, we get 
Claude pretty much back to full. Um, and a dead Pult, which is really, really solid. Uh, definitely going to be saving this Pokemon. This Mon honestly can kind of just wall everybody, which is hilarious. Um, but we will save this specifically for Palafin. So it can't lock into a water move. Even though close combat looks more scarier. But once again, Claude Sire. So who knows. Let's see what they want to do. I think they would either go into King Gambit or the other guy. They go Annihilate. Oh, this is threatening. This is threatening. I think I'm going to go Hard Cat. Uh, so I can crit through bulk ups. I think that's my best play. I think everything else is too passive. Um, it won't do enough damage to anything. Because they probably taunt here, which is perfectly fine with me. Uh, yep, they do. Perfect. So yeah, I could definitely um, Flower Trick or Play Rough. Both are viable options for me. And I think I might play Rough. Super effective Banded. We do turn into the Fairy type, so that means we resist the fighting move that they probably go for. And they just drop. So the Protean starter that's popping off is, ironically enough, not Grenadier. But it is the Cat. So if they go out into King Gambit, I will stay in and play rough to get Chip on it. Um, they go Palafin, actually. I am a Fairy type. I literally have Claude, bro. Like, you can't do anything to Claude unless you, like, Raw Zen Headbutt here. Zero to Hero. Uh, so yeah, we'll go Claude. And then as soon as I can Shed Tail with Cyclozar, we'll be solid, bro. So yeah, bringing in the homie. They Ice Punch. Oh, they got the prediction prediction. Okay. Um, well, that's fine. Because now I get a free SD with, with uh, Gren. I get a free SD with Gren. This is perfect. I'm an SD with Gren. Um, what are spikes? Hopefully, Palafin's Ice Punch doesn't Oko me. Level 50. Jolly. Ice Punch. To Greninja. Um, Ice Punch definitely doesn't too. Okay, let's do it. We're doing it. We're doing it. We're doing it. Let's go. And then, and then, if oh no, we're gonna SD into the normal type, aren't we? We can tear a we can tear a Gunk Shot though at some point. So yeah, let's just SD. It's free. This is free. This is so free. Look at my guy. He's looking so good. I wanted to shiny hunt him, which I probably did end up doing yesterday. But I uh, wanted to get the video uh, done and recorded before I started that. They do Ice Punch. Yeah, we're going to be tanking this. you love to see it. No Freeze? No Freeze. This kind of sucks because we no longer resist. Uh-oh. Wait a minute. Ice Punch. If I'm normal type. 46 to 55. Damn, I'm only going to get one kill here. That's unfortunate. Um, That's very unfortunate. Why'd they stay in? Night Slash... 252, Life Orb. I assume it kills. 74 to 87, it doesn't kill. I have to go for Gunk Shot. We're doing it. We don't miss around here. We don't miss around here, brothers. This is where uh, Battle Bond would have been better, but I don't know if that's available in game yet or not. This is just the Raid Greninja, you know what I mean? This is just the Raid Greninja in all its glory. Land the Gunk Shot, brother. Come on, tank the Ice Punch. Tanking it. Land. Good job, Gren. The Gren Showcase, guys. The Gren Showcase. Oh, man. <laughs> you love you love to see it, honestly, you know? The Gren Showcase, guys. I mean, we're still going to win, I think. But, goddamn, you know? It's a little shitty. Just a little bit. Just a wee bit. Just a wee bit. Just a wee bit unfortunate. Did some decent damage. We'll roost this next turn. And eh, we kind of don't really need to, but I will. That's so unfortunate, bro. You try to show off Gren, and you get punished by missing. At least we'll most likely be able to win this one. But damn, dude. 
Come on, Gren. I guess I should just attack, but that's silly. It was, he was not doing enough damage. Like, let's be real, guys. My guy was not doing enough damage. Brave Bird once more. Yes, sir. And then we'll roost again. And then we'll body press. Uh, actually, we don't really need to. We can just body press here. That's so unfortunate. That's so shitty. Uh, at least we can we can body press the King Gambit, so we definitely switch out in front of that. I mean, we switch out in front of Armourouge to save Corviknight for King Gambit. This is why you don't want to run Gunk Shot Greninja. This is why you run Special Greninja. Marisa sent out the Guardian, and it is this guy. So yeah, we have Banded Cat in the back, so I'm cool with uh, just sacking something else off. Um, we'll just go Cyclozar, see what they want to do. Uh, we can click a Draco so that we don't pop their weak weak armor, and then uh, actually, if they just like calm on here, I'll shadow, I'll shed tail. <laughs> okay, let's go. Wow, I did not think they would calm on actually. Yeah, we can just shed tail here into the cat to get a free switch. They didn't Terra yet themselves, so I guess they could Terra Grass here. Um, but we'll shed tail. Young Shedder. Uh, they definitely click a Psychic move here too, so that'd be pretty funny if I go the cat as they click the Psychic move. And then I'm immune, and then I'm behind my, <gasps> then I'm behind my sub. I guess this is the cat showcase instead, <laughs> which is funny because I haven't really gotten a, a Meowskarada video. Pretty hilarious. Or a sphere, of course. Why not? But yeah, we're just gonna click banded knockoff. Uh, I do believe I have knockoff. Uh, no priority on my side, but I feel like I might be able to live a hit with Quinlanya. So yeah, we're just gonna banded knockoff. If the weakness pot not weakness policy. If the weak armor, the weak armor. Um, but I guess if they tear a grass here, that's not the worst case scenario. And it looks like they're not gonna terrestrialize, and we will just be knocking them out. Yes, sir. Bandit cat's insane. Try to make a Greninja showcase and the other Protean Mon right ran away with it. You know what I mean? It's kinda funny. It's whatever. We'll keep it. We'll get it going. Gren Gren video will be coming soon still. And then Magisteria, the Paldea champion. And is it Supreme Overlord? It is all right so they could definitely click a button here uh, i'm just gonna click knock off get off to get rid of their item uh potentially see what terror type they turn into because if it's flying then i can't really body press and they do uh they do terrestrialize into the dark type maybe i am dark myself so a sucker punch won't be knocking me out into the steel type perfect perfect now they don't resist my knockoff and now we're going to be doing big boy damage And body press is still super effective. And we still have a uh, assault vest. So they can SD. And we still have a uh, uh, Cinderace. Although I do think we die to one sucker. I imagine we die to a sucker. Uh, so we're gonna go everybody else first. We're gonna make this interesting. Uh, we're gonna go we're gonna go Cinderace first. And we're gonna click Pyro Ball. Can't believe my man missed a gunk shot. What's the accuracy on gunk shot? Does anybody know? Let me know in the comment section down below. I don't want to look it up right now. We're gonna Pyro Ball. And end the battle with using all of the starters. You'd love to see it. Everyone on the team got to do something except Grenadier. <laughs> Who would have thought? It's hilarious. That's hilarious. But I guess that's the Protean starter showcase. Um, if you all like what you saw and you saw what you like, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. If you do, make sure if you end up using the team, let me know in the comment section down below. If you ended up landing your gunk shots, I'll probably make another variant with a special Greninja. Just so I don't have any scenarios like that. Uh, but with that being said, I'm going to get up out of here. Uh, if y'all like what you saw and you saw what you like, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you're new, and we'll see you in the next one. <gasps> Peace.